FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Friday, the 5th of April. We're looking at the Dow at this 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Uh, we're looking at the Dow for 128 at 38,721. Look at this red candle over 500, just a, maybe an 800 point move intraday. You went right through the insight. I'm going to talk about this in my show coming up, Tiger Technicians Hour. It's Technical Friday. This inside track support level just it fell right through it. This is a sell mode in the Dow daily chart. Let's go to the S&P. Oh, and the nine period moving average finally crossed negative. And that's from November the 3rd until yesterday, uh, April the 3rd. That's uh, <laughs> five months, right? Um, finally, it turned down. What a, what a beautiful indicator that is. So looking at the S&P, the S&P right now is uh, trading up 30. Let me just get this right here. There we go. S&P. Uh, oh. Come on. There it is. S&P is up 30 after a really sharp move into the inside track repellent zone, uh, propellant zone, which is now repellent zone. And that makes the 50, uh, 5198 level very strong resistance right now. It's at 5178 up 30. We're looking at the QQQ and that nine period moving average is still positive. The QQQ, though, went negative at the close yesterday. It's at 438.40 up three. After a really sharp move, remember I drew in that falling axe resistance level, didn't take it out. In fact, it went right below the support level and the inside track support level. So this is going to be really important. 432 is absolutely key to hold over the next couple of days. IWM, the Russell 2000, also took quite a beating. Uh, it's up today, 22 cents at 203.97. 9 period moving average hasn't yet crossed negative. It's just so close, but it hasn't done that. Let's go to gold. Gold is holding very well considering <clears throat> Uh, everything that's going on. This tells me this is a geopolitical aspect that we're looking at. Up nine at 2317. Uh, the all time high was yesterday. And so it's holding very well in leg D. But wait a minute, the dollar, dollar is also moving higher. Dollar, in fact, is very sharply higher. Up 36. This is, an, this is the currency, the, the international currency of uh, import. So we've got 104.58, up 35. And those bonds, wow. We can gain today down 22 30 seconds. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Very, very important session because I'm going to show you all the technical.